Hi everyone, I'm Aaron Eckhoff here. I'm the head of maths here at OICB and I'm just going to explain a little bit about the different maths competitions that we do here and how they can be useful for students to partake in, not just for improving themselves but also for university applications. And so this month is quite an exciting month for us because we get to get our younger students involved in some of the uh, competitions that are coming up. And the first one coming up is actually with the UKMT Trust, which is the Intermediate Maths Challenge. Now, this is a set of 25 multiple choice questions that the students have to try to navigate. Each question is worth a certain number of marks. Um, and if they answer a question correct, they get six marks. And if they get one wrong, they actually get negative three. So there's a little bit of strategy going on here. Um, and in Maths Club, this term, our sole focus with these kids is to get them ready for this challenge. Now, one of the reasons why the students might do that is obviously to have a challenge, that's number one, uh, but two, they just like math, so it's nice to have different types of problems that are sitting outside the curriculum. But obviously, thirdly, in the long-term picture, these are things that they can discuss and, and mention as they apply to university. And universities do like to see kids doing things outside of the curriculum as well. So that's the first one. And then the second one is actually a follow-on round from the American Maths Challenge. And we've got six students that have qualified for that, which will run on the 7th of February. Now, this is a three and a half hour exam, so it's going to be full on, very difficult. And the kids, are, I know, are already preparing and looking forward to the challenge. But again, this is your 12 students, your 11 students, and all of this experience is going to be useful for their university applications. So good luck to everyone. That's the information for me. If you have any questions, do get in touch.